Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Kurt Buchanan and I'm really happy you decided to click on my video. I want to thank you so very much for that and I do want to say I really do appreciate it. In tonight's video, I'm actually going to be showing you guys how you can start a real business online using a free Google Chrome extension by the name of Facebook Pixel Helper. So I'm going to show you what it is, talk to you about it, and I'm going to show you how you can use it to find clients that you can target uh, to get them to pay you money to set up the Facebook pixel on their websites and to help them to set up Facebook ad campaigns to help them to get a lot more customers for their business. All right, before I actually get started though, I do want to say if you're here and you're not subscribed to my channel, I do want to encourage you to hit that subscribe button because I'm always putting out some great content for you guys, showing you guys different ways and methods of making money online. All right, so now to tonight's uh, episode, tonight's content. Uh, first thing you actually want to do is to get the uh, Facebook Pixel Helper Chrome extension installed. And you want to go to the Chrome Web Store to do so. So you want to go to chrome.google.com slash web store uh, slash categories slash extension. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave links in the description. So you may want to check that out at the end of the video to find all the links you will need to get this thing started. All right, so basically let's find the Facebook Pixel Helper um, Chrome extension. Uh, and then I'm going to talk to you about what it is and I'm gonna show you how it works and how you can use it uh, to make some money online. All right, so this is a Facebook Pixel Helper here. That's the one you wanna install. It has over 715,000 users. Um, uh, four and a half star review. And basically what this is saying here is that the Facebook Pixel Helper works in the background to look for conversion of pixel of Facebook pixels and provide real-time feedback on the implementation, All right? So a small number will appear on the Facebook Pixel Helper icon to indicate number of pixel events. All right, so basically you can uh, install different number of pixel events on one website at a time. All right, so if you don't have it installed yet, you want to click on Add to Chrome. Mine is currently saying Add it to Chrome to show that I have it installed. And this is what it looks like here. Mine is currently grayed out. Uh, once you visit a website and there is an active pixel on that website, then it turns to blue. And I'm going to show you all of that in a second. So, all right, so basically the Facebook pixel tracks uh, information, tracks persons who visit uh, websites. So they can use that data to send uh, to show them targeted ads uh, when they're on the Facebook um, uh, domain. All right. So basically, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you a website that I'm sure has a Facebook Pixel installed. All right. And then I'm going to go to my Facebook profile and show you an ad that I'm currently being served from this website because I visited this website and they have a Pixel installed on the website. So Dropified is the name of this website. Um, Dropify is basically a, a software that you can use to do dropshipping from different suppliers, similar to Overlo um, if you're into dropshipping. All right, so as you can see, it is saying I have pixels installed here, page view and microdata. So this is a pixel uh, ID and it shows you what type of pixels are installed on this website. So basically page view, anyone who visits this website, this pixel data will start tracking that person. Uh, so when they go to Facebook or Instagram, uh, they will be served ads from uh, Dropify. So let me just go to my Facebook page right away and show you. As you can see here, this is a Dropify.com uh, serving me an ad to say, hey, you have visited our site recently, and that's because of the pixel data. All right, so let me show you how you can actually use this now to make some money. All right, so basically you want to go to Google, and you want to search for different uh, professions where you know uh, that money is, different businesses. All right, so you want to search for anything in the medical field. So uh, let's start with dentists. So I'm going to search for dentist in a certain zip code, 11423, which is in uh, New York. All right, so basically I'm searching for dentist in this zip code. So what I'm going to do here is giving me a list of dentists here. And as you can see, there are lots of dentists in that uh, zip code. So I'm going to go to more places to expand this to get a full list just to show you that there are lots of different dentists here that we could actually target, all right, to find out if their website is using Facebook Pixel and if they are currently running ad campaigns on their Facebook pages. So I'm just going to click on this first one here. Um, you can click here to, uh, to view 
different reviews and to get images of the actual location and to get phone number but what i want to do is to go to the website all right so once i'm on this website what i'm looking for is to see if this facebook pixel uh helper is going to be um highlighted blue to tell me if there is a pixel installed on this website so currently there is no pixel on this website no facebook pixel is installed here and the next thing you actually want to look for is the facebook uh, social media link to see if they have a facebook page so this uh, particular hillside family dental currently has a facebook page so i'm just going to click on that to go take a look on their facebook page to see if they're actually currently boosting uh, any post on their facebook page and to see what is happening on that facebook page all right so um, this Facebook page looks really nice, a nice uh, header, nice um, profile image, currently only has 87 likes. So what I'm looking for here, I'm going to click on post just to see if uh, the kind of activity that each post is getting on this website. So this post was made January 19th, no uh, engagement. This one was made January 12th, no engagement. This one, January 5th, no engagement. So as you can see, they're not currently uh, running any boosted posts on this Facebook page, as far as my knowledge can uh, tell me. So basically what you want to do from here is to send them a message. You can either contact them through the Facebook page or you can go back to the website and try to get in contact with the uh, this business to say, hey, I realize you're not using the Facebook pixel on your website and you're currently not running any Facebook ads on Facebook. Why is this so? Um, and then you can sell your services of creating and setting up Facebook ad campaigns to get them a lot more customers and to set up the Facebook pixel that they can use to retarget customers on Facebook who visit their website. So basically from here, you can either grab their email address uh, to contact them or you can contact them on Facebook here. So for example, you just click on this send message button and say uh, you can be a, a professional if you want. Um, I do suggest you keep it professional but fun at the same time uh, just to get uh, a reply from inside family dental or whichever business you uh, so decide to target. So this guys is a, a an actual business uh, model that you can use, you can replicate uh, for yourself. Uh, to find different clients using the Facebook Pixel Helper and if that customer doesn't, if that uh, uh, lead uh, doesn't have the Facebook Pixel installed on their website then you can uh, get in contact with these businesses uh, selling your services of uh, setting Facebook ad campaigns and uh, setting up the Facebook Pixel on their website as well. If the website doesn't have a Facebook page then that's even more business for you to uh, encourage them to create a Facebook page uh, to get involved in internet marketing as it relates to social media marketing on Facebook. All right, so there are lots of different opportunities out there. Uh, I could go on and on. Once you set up the Facebook pixel and you uh, create ads on their Facebook page, then you could move into setting up Facebook bots, um, chat bots for uh, those uh, businesses as well. All right, so if you're new to chat bots or you don't know what chat bots are, I'm going to leave a link in the description as well so you can check that out to find out what chat bots are. So as you can see here, you can create an entire business uh, using this method, using a free Google Chrome extension and targeting different clients uh, in wherever, any uh, area, any zip code, any country that you actually do want to target uh, your clients in. All right, so that's where I'm going to end this video. If you do want to see a follow-up uh, tutorial uh, on this, then you can always leave me a comment below. Uh, drop a like on this video and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel uh, if you want to be updated with similar content of different ways to show you how you can make money online. So thank you so very much for watching and I will see you in my next video.